So how do I do this? Bhagavad Gita verse chapter 2 verse 48 Yogastaha Kuru Kar Karmani San Sangam Tiaktwa Dhan Dhanan now watch the end every time I press equals it changes its form Dhanan Jaya Sitya Sid Sid Hyoho Samo Bhutwa Sama Twam Samatwam Yoga Uchyate. So the point is, I'm using a standard US layout keyboard, and it's a simple app that I've launched. And every time you specify or press an equals after a certain letter, for example, uh, a U, it changes, or an N, every time I press equals, it keeps changing and you can specify what letter it changes based on simply including it inside a config file so for example here I put M that means the original M after you press equals once then it's going to change it into an M with a dot underneath you press equals again and it changes to an M with a dot on top and when you press it again it goes back to the original for example here's an M I press equal once I press equals again and it goes back to normal so that means this can not only be used for Sanskrit transliteration but for basically any language because you can put any character you want you can even put a capital letter so this saves you a lot of time when dealing with different languages yet you're using a standard US keyboard layout because that means you can just take that special character and you can assign it after the letter so the way it works is uh, you simply launch keyswap it's a very small application that uh, is uh, loaded in the Windows taskbar but you can also exit it or there's a right click and it says add to startup so that means the key swap application can uh, launch automatically every time you start Windows and it's for free it's available for anyone who is involved in typing in different foreign languages or special characters without having to launch any special applications uh, on the web also this works not only in word but it works anywhere it works in windows in facebook messenger typing a simple url it works absolutely anywhere in your windows operating system so it's going to save you a lot of time and that was the purpose of creating this software. Okay, so the download link is on the bottom of this video. Thanks for listening.